Hi everybody and welcome to Math 107. Congratulations for getting started logging on to Canvas. Um, so I'm just going to give you an overview of how the class works and um, so just to begin with it, it might seem a bit overwhelming but there's really just three things you need to think about. I gotta play a video and write down the examples that I see on the screen right so you just click on the video you can put it in full screen and just imagine you're in a classroom and you're writing stuff off the whiteboard okay and that's all you have to do um, that's the most important thing in the class play those video examples write write them down don't just watch it you got to write um, every student I've ever had who has, uh, you know, almost every student I've ever had who has written down the video examples has, has passed the class and done well, right? So um, that's the first thing, video notes. Second thing is you do this textbook homework that's listed on Canvas. Not all of the textbook homework, just what's listed on Canvas. And then you do the next video, play it, write down the examples on paper, then do the textbook homework, show all your work. Uh, next video and so on and then you come to the quiz you click on the quiz and you take it right and that's essentially it I mean every day you're doing three things video notes textbook homework quiz okay that essentially now there's some other details along the way and we'll go over it but and when it when you're taking a quiz oftentimes I'm just going to ask you to um, plug in um, like the answer to question two from the textbook right or the answer to question four from the textbook or question five from the textbook. Does that make sense? So um, let's see. So, so that, that's a, the, the, the basics of the course. And now let's go over some details. Um, so just watch out that sometimes you might need, you could use some graph paper um, if we're doing graphs, if you, if, you, if you can't open that, just use any type of grid paper you have. You might like to print the actual uh, video examples. Um, oh, where are they at? There we go. You might like to uh, print these video examples and um, you can follow along easier. You don't have to do that though. If you don't have a printer, that's perfectly fine. Just um, play the video and write down whatever I'm writing. You, you could just, you don't even have to write down all of the text on, you, you know, the actual questions. Just write down what I'm writing, if that makes sense. Okay. Um, let's see. There are some discussions in the course. Um, if there's ever a homework problem where you've got to write an English sentence to give the answer, then don't write that English sentence on paper. You want to be writing that online in a um, in a online discussion so that and 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 also with these so so that I can see it right away and we can have a class discussion on it and you can see your classmates responses and then your instructors responses and then you can update and say oh darn it I, I didn't think of that or so you can improve your response okay so that's how we're, we're gonna try to have some class discussions on different uh, topics um, and if you need help with anything yeah you go to math help um, or homework sharing and those will be described so I mean that's essentially how the class functions um, so the question is like I guess how do you turn in your paperwork and then how do you take a test right well let's see um, you will be taking a test at the end of so if I if I look at I, I'm in this particular course in this module and at the end of the module there's a proctor chapter test so it's got to be proctored so so um, if you're taking it from home um, we're in, in math 107 here we're probably going to use a, a thing called honor lock so I'll keep you updated on that but that would have to be proctored from home and then you turn your video notes and textbook homework in here there's this quiz right and uh, so if I click on that, um, there's a couple of questions and this one asks me to upload pictures of my video notes and textbook homework and this one asks me to upload the schedule if you have it. Um, and we're going to teach you how to combine images into one PDF file if needed, right? 
and that's how you turn in your works. I mean, that's an overview of the course, but uh, what I'd like you to do is go through this entire orientation step by step. Um, and, you know, for each one, like with the textbook, I've actually made a separate little video that talks about uh, the textbook. It's like a minute long and you can see all about that there and so on. So, so make sure, I just want you to do all of the orientation tasks. Like look at every single page, watch all the little videos and let's get ready and, and properly prepared for this course. Um, and, and then at the end of it, take the orientation quiz and um, you'll also be uh, either giving me a phone call or popping into a Zoom meeting so that we can um, double check the instructions for the class. All right. And you'll get a bunch of points once you've done this on your orientation tasks. OK, so there we have it. Welcome to the class. Um, and it, it might look overwhelming, but I just go back to the fact that there's really three things you need to do. Video notes, textbook homework, take a quiz every day. Video notes, textbook homework, take a quiz. And out of those, the most important thing is the video homework. I mean, um, this is your class attendance. Um, and like I said, I, I try to explain all of the concepts and all of the problems that we're going to do in these videos. And um, if you follow along, write down what I'm writing down on the videos, then you should do just fine on the textbook homework and you should be able to do the quizzes and do fine on the tests and tests and it'll all work out. Um, just a heads up now on 2.1 that we only have one textbook homework question. It's just question number six after this video. And then we have uh, three videos that are basically review. There's no textbook homework questions associated with them, but there are questions similar to them on the quiz. Okay.